Hi friends, remember last week we started to learn about the geometric solids. Well, today we are going to learn three more of the geometric solids. So if you're ready, let's review the ones that we learned last week and then I'll teach you three new ones. If you remember last week, we learned the cube, the cylinder, and the sphere. The cube, the cylinder, and the sphere. So now let's see which ones you remember. Show me the sphere. Here it is. Show me the cube. The cube. And now show me the cylinder. The cylinder. What is this one? Can you remember the name of this one? This is a cylinder. Good job. What about this one? Can you remember the name of this one? A sphere. Great job. And lastly, what is this one? Can you remember the name of this one? A cube. Fantastic job. Now we are ready to learn three new geometric solids. Today we will be learning about the cone, the rectangular prism, and the triangular prism. So first let's look at the cone. A cone has one circular base and then on this side it doesn't have a base. Instead, it comes up to a point. Can you see the point? This is a cone. This shape is a rectangular prism. And look, it has four sides. One, two, three, four that are rectangles. And it has two bases. And what shape is that? What shape do you see here? A square. Now, this is called a rectangular prism, but did you know that even a square is actually a special type of rectangle? So even though these are rectangles and these are squares, all of the bases on this prism are actually rectangles, even the sides that are squares. And then lastly, let's look at the triangle prism triangular prism. It has two bases that are shaped like what? Like triangles. So two bases shaped like triangles, the triangular prism. This is a cone. This is a rectangular prism. And this is a triangular prism. Show me the triangular prism. Here it is. Show me the cone. Here is the cone. And show me the rectangular prism. Here it is. Great job. Now let's see if you can remember the names all by yourself. What is this shape? A cone. Great job. What is this shape? A rectangular prism. Great job. And what is this shape? A triangular prism. Fantastic. The last thing we are going to do today is go on a scavenger hunt to find something in your house that is in the shape of each of these geometric solids. So you need to go look for something that's shaped like a cone, something that's shaped like a rectangular prism, and something that is shaped like a triangular prism. All right, so go look for those items, and when you come back, I'll show you what I found. Okay guys, now let me show you what I found in my house. So this tree is actually shaped like a cone. Look, a cone. It has a circular base and it comes up to a point at the top. Cone. Uh, 
I found this box of tea that is a rectangular prism. Look, a rectangular prism. It has four, sh four sides shaped like rectangles and it has two bases, one here and one here. And actually these are a little bit more rectangular than this one. This one is more square. So this is a rectangular prism, this box. And last, I found a triangular prism. And you know what, this is actually a toy from one of my son's lessons that he has where he has to sort the shapes. And I got very lucky because look, this is the exact same triangular prism. It's just a little bit smaller. And what color is it? It's yellow and ours is blue. Triangular prism. Let's put it like that so you can see. Okay, friends, I hope you had fun learning today about the cone, the rectangular prism, and the triangular prism. These are all very nice geometric solids. So I hope you had a wonderful time in learning about them. I look forward to seeing you next time. Have a great day. Bye.